today I actually decided to try the famous bunnies from um, Ken Cutters in Amshlanga. So just gonna head on there and we're gonna get bunny chow in. start eating I just had to get me a good cappuccino get the energy rolling so I can start eating so you can take a look at that that's actually good and then I've got um, a bombay crush as well I think this has ice cream and a bit of milk with some looks like strawberry syrup or something like that and a bit of cream so we're gonna give it a try Oh, that's refreshing. There's some chewy stuff in the bottom. I'm not too sure what's there. That's actually nice. As you can see, <coughs> okay, in the bottom, it's actually nice and sweet as well. So the chef actually um, was making something in the kitchen, and I think it's uh, paratha. It looks like a paratha, but I think it has uh, cheese and uh, potato in it. You can take a look. Let's give this a try. Mm. It's actually nice. You get a little bit spicy flavor from the potato, but that cheese, that cheese works well. As Mm. But that cheese hanging there. <laughs> Thanks to the chef for this. <clears throat> it's actually nice. My bunny has arrived and this actually looks good. It's not, not very dry, it's nice and moist with a lot of gravy. And uh, yeah, it's actually looking good. So, first you gotta take your bread and you gotta dip it in. Get all that gravy in. Oh, not forgetting some lovely vinegar chilies. It has a nice kick to it as well. Just look at that. That is good. Let's get a bit of some meat, a bit of carrots, and the chili. Mm. That is flavorful. Take a look at how nice this looks. The smell itself makes you just want to eat the whole thing. Let's break another piece. This is how I like my bunny. Not dry. Good meat, good gravy, and some good flavor as well. As you can see guys, I've chowed this thing down. <clears throat> There's just a small piece left. We should be out in about a minute or so. 
if you're in the area of Amstranga, you come down to King Carlos, get yourself a chow, get yourself a banyan like I did, and their service is actually exceptional. Good service, good food. I actually give it a 9 out of 10. Definitely another chili. Guys, I'm all done. Place is clean. Service exceptional. That again, and I'm just gonna have a little break, have some some more coffee, and from here we're gonna head down to RK's. They, I think they serve um, just vegetarian, <laughs> but we're gonna check what's happening there, see what they have, and taste some of the stuff they have there. So guys, we just finished at um, King Cutters and now we're gonna head on to um, RK's to check what they have. They are a vegetarian place, so I'm not sure what they're gonna have, but let's go have a look. Okay guys, I think RK's is more of um, like a quick buy thing that you can get and uh, I just got me some gulab jam, some barfi and some jalebi as well. Uh, so let's try the first thing that's here is gulab jam. Okay, it looks kind of nice. Mm. It's actually nice and soft. But it's not much crisp. I like it when it's like got a crispy part on the top and it gives you that nice crunch. It's sweet though. Hmm. Let me try some jalebi now. This is nice and big. Nice and bright orange. Let's give it a taste. I like the crunch. A bit too sweet for me though. But it's nice, not bad. And lastly, let's try some barfi. This is actually quite a big piece. I didn't expect it to be so big. But let's give it a try. We had a good day experiencing some good food, uh, some good sweet meats as well. Don't forget to click the little bell icon, like and subscribe. Give me a comment, give me a thumbs up as well. And see you on the next one.